Okay, so Triforce Hunt is a bit different than Ye old Normal Seed. In so much as you're not looking to defeat Ganon, you are looking to find 20 of 30 Triforce pieces that are scattered about Hyrule. And as soon as you get the 20th, that's it. Game over, you are done. So, it should, in theory, be a lot quicker than a normal seed. My first two have gone super well. One was like a bucko, like a buck ten, and my second one's like a 53 or something, so it ended up being real nice. Real nice and short, comparatively speaking. And really, what I should be doing is having different, like, routing and strats for it, but I usually follow my normal routing for it anyways, so... Let's see what we can pull off this time in three... Two, one, go, 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 old 20 at the house this time. All right. We probably won't see too much different than the way I play this, honestly. Although I'm going to stay more away from dungeons than I would typically. But singles at the fucking cold tree. For the simple fact that there are 30 Triforce pieces in total and we only need 20 of them, so the likelihood that any single chest will be locking us out of a victory is pretty pretty slim. It's got a fiver, got not so much change after visiting the strip club last night, hence why he's passed out in the sewer. Oh, hey, there's our very first one in the fucking sewer entrance, so first Dorito at one minute in. <laughs> not bad, not bad at all, not bad. It's it's a good indicator. Maybe for a shield in the church. Fortunately, not enough money for bombs, and no bombs period to get us into Kakariko, so whatever. Tree was only single, so we're not even gonna bother with that again. And even though it's not terribly likely that the Lumberjack Cave will have something that'll block us, it could, by some slim chance, still have an important item, and it has a sword. Ugh. So pretty unlikely we're gonna be going for that. Unless, unless by some miraculous coincidence we need to kill Egg of One to get into Dark World anyways. Oh, we didn't check the crab drop. Crab dropping, no, oh, crab dropping parts. If he was dropping bombs like last time, it would have been real good. Uh, you know what, we'll grab it, why not? Early boots yet again. My goodness. That is some good ass luck. Will not sneeze at getting boots early. That's pretty good. Kakariko, normally a hotbed of good items, at least from the start. Might also turn into a hotbed of Doritos. Would very much be okay for me. I think the last two seeds I've done of this, I ended up walking out of Kakariko with 5 of 20, so... I'd be okay with more of that, please. And some bombs also, please. Uh, not those. Whoa! Early-ass silvers! Hell yeah. And a hammer. Interesting. Very interesting. I mean, silvers are good and cool. Early on, I need a bow to make use of them. But hey, I, I won't. I won't complain about getting them. Getting silvers. Certainly not. All right. So now we've got the money for some bombs. 
And even more money for bombs. And some hearts. Okay. okay. Can't be disappointed by that. Excuse me. Starting with boots and hammer, straight out of Kakariko would be not a bad start to a normal seed either, let's be honest. What the hell? Pretty good chicken throw. Did we get to the other side? We did! Nice. Vendor money by the time we get out of Blind's Hut again. Oh, and there's our bow! Holy shit! That is the earliest bow and silver combo I have ever seen. Five and a half minutes in. That gives us a good go at things over for Eastern if we so choose to go over there. It's not a bad play, really, for three items. Got another 20 in the well, but that's all right. That's okay. It's some okay garbage we've got so far. Kakariko not being heavy on the Doritos. But, has been giving us some other good shit, so I cannot complain too loudly about it. Oh, hey, speaking of which, there's our second Dorito. We forgot to accost the bottle vendor for our shit here. Eh? Oh, literacy! He's selling books, not bottles! Bro, oops, excuse me, ma'am. So, early literacy, early boots, early bow and arrow. My goodness. Oh, single arrow of destiny on the library. Wow. I mean, that would be one bullet for our bow, so. How about the race game? What's the race game got? Nothing but a big old 20. Not worth it. Mayhaps. Nope, nothing but a big old 20. No, I'm actually gonna grab that one. We're a little light on cash. Certainly don't mind picking up a little extra every now and again. It's gonna be a little dicey because hitbox on the hammer sucks. <laughs> it really does. Ah, uh, I wish I had some arrows or something. Damn it. 
Come on, like, what do you have to do for that? God, I hate using the hammer on Mini War Milan. Fucks. It's such a dumb bullshit hitbox when you're trying to hit up. It's like got all the fucking wiggle room in the world if you're trying to hit from the north. Heaven forbid you want to hit something from below. Jank-ass hitbox. Alright, let's try this again. Thank you. Okay, that went better. Somehow. Big old Tony. Arrow cap. It's candy. Lamp, nice. And hey, there's our first sword, about 10 minutes in. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Lamp and a sword. Lamp and a sword. So, that gets us to escape real nice. Ouch. Both front and back side, assuming we get the key in the middle. Also puts us in good position to go hit up Eastern and Sahatch for a total of six items. Ah, there's Quake Arena. All right. Let's go escape. Escape first, then we can head on over to Eastern. You stop with the sword tanks. Get out of here with that shit. Never have that problem ever. It's happened twice in the span of a minute. Oh, Samaria. How interesting. More of a tool than anything absolutely required now in this sort of run, but hey, whatever. damage here since we're going to try for the death warp. Oh, big three hundo. That's nice to see. It's pretty close to Zora money. Even if we can't strictly get up to Zora without fake filtering at the moment. This guy in tech so he can do the do the death war. Idiot. There we go. And nothing but a burrito. Alright, so we're not gonna be able to do the rest of um, of escape since we don't have that small key. But we can go do bonk rocks, and then we can go hit up Sasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasas
your sword at the Bonk Rocks. How interesting. And also awesome. Oh, that's right. We've got literacy, too. So, we can go over to Desert. Desert Ledge, etc. But the concentration of six items here over with Sahastra Shrasharala and Eastern Palace is a pretty good play as well. If it could have given me at least one Dorito, that'd be real nice. piece of candy, and a bee in a bottle. Alright, well, not exactly Value City over here, but that does get us to a uh, sick kid as well. Straight from the start, huh? This really doesn't matter all that much. I would have preferred the hook shot so we can quickie on this chest over here. That's alright, though. Take that. Not strictly necessary, but nice to have some fire defense. Check if this was like green pendant or something, so might just duck out if this ends up being the last item or these. Shots. Wow, that is a fucking strong item there. Okay, well, the sooner we can get up to the mountain, then, the better it'll be. Looks like we're gonna have to probably go desert next, I think.
we have been on a a pretty long Dorito drought here. Usually the early game is rife with them. That's all right though. It might make it up for it. Might make up for it in the late game. What we got on the ledge there. Ten arrows. Eh. I mean, I could use some arrows, but not enough to go down for the ledge. All that leaves really just sick kid and sick kid and whatever's in the desert. Oh, I suppose technically I could have gone for that, uh, could have gone for the dark room item, couldn't I have? I didn't need that other small key, did I? Maybe I did. I'm not sure what the rules are surrounding that, uh, dark room and escape there. If I hadn't have gotten a small key there or whatever. I'm pretty sure I made the right call by not going for it. The big key. Alright, well, we're looking for something of uh, progressive value here, like uh, a glove would probably be the best at this point. Get us up the mountain. Hey, look at that. What did I just say? <laughs> a glove would be real nice. Alright, that gets us a whole lot. to use it with, except uh, Samaria, I think. Samaria and the lamp, I suppose. But, we now have mountain access, so let's go for it. Hookshot and hammer gets us up to Hera. We've got a book and a master sword gets us ether tab. Pretty much clear the entirety of it, except whatever's on top. A spec rock, and of course, whatever is on the floating island. gonna block me from going further, isn't he? Oh, no, okay. Got it that time. Jeez. Yeah, radar straight up their ass. Block me everywhere. Alright, that's no big deal. What did we get from the old man? We got like a 20 or something? Nothing of value, really? Oh, there is a piece up on top of Spec Rock. Well, we might not need it. Uh, what do we got in there? Oh, that's a shield. I don't know if I want to get the fucking blast shield. Hey, Sonic Shard, how you doing? Good to see you. Uh, I'm not going to bother with that shield. We don't need it. We already got the fire shield. That's about as much protection as we're going to need. Get out of here, uh, squirrels! <laughs> Stupid piece of shit. Do not like it. Do not like it at all. All right, well, if we get the mirror, we've got easy access to one of the shards, so... Or one of the... Excuse me, one of the pieces of Triforce. <coughs> Mm. But we've got so many other chances here now. Other pieces of stuff. So let's see what we get. 
Yeah, all right, there's number four and a fiver. Zora money, another big 20. Another big 20. Another Dorito, that's number five. And a blast heart container. All right, not bad. Pretty good haul so far. Still got Death Mountain, or still got Spiral Cave. We can check what's on Floating Island. We can go into Hera if we need to. I guess it's two quick items. We got up there. Ooh, we got another one on the floating island. So, once we get the mirror, we will have access to two quick pieces of trifles. That would be real handy if we get to the 18 mark. Uh, let's check ether tab real quick like. Ether tab. Damn. All right, that gets us into Dark World. Doesn't quite get us to Dark Side Death Mountain here, but spiral key. Yeah. Oh, but if we do somehow manage to scam the mitts, oh, there is number six in Hera. Excelente. Um, do I have a distance thing? I've got arrows. There we go. Once again, heading into the basement of Hera, so this is gonna be a big old waste of time. But hey, if it gets us Titan's Mitts or whatever, it's all worth it. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. All right, so, well, let's see here. We got the glove, so that gets us into Backside of Escape and the Dark Room, so that's another four there. We can get into Dark World over at Kakariko, so that's a bunch of items over there. Oh, plus we are fully loaded for Pod, which is another five items, so... We're looking pretty good as far as places we can go. Even if we're not strictly doing great as far as the seed is concerned. There's the big ass key as expected. what I'm going to do is take a quick pop outside and see if this is a, a crystal or a pendant. Not that it really matters, but if it's like green pendant, yeah, it is green pendant. So maybe we'll, uh, we'll finish it off regardless. So that gets us another extra item. We go back to Sashrash or Shrash or Oh, dang it. That was silly. Item number two, so we can go straight up to Moldorm, kick him in the face, and be like, Yeah, I'm out of here. Oh, 
Bom bom ba da ba ba da bom 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 ba oh jeez almost with the immediate fucking down stop stop why why does that happen I had my sword out that's supposed to prevent it boo fuck you Wormulon piece of shit dumb spot to be in. Piece of shit, trying to do it again. No, what the hell? I had my sword out, what the fuck? Excuse me with that. Ah, this is the dumbest bullshit I've ever seen. Fuck you, Wormulon. Come on, this should be just the, the quickest ass boss fight here. If you're being a pain. Don't be a pain. Why? Why? See, why didn't you do that the first time? Piece of shit. Alright. Well, it's not looking good for a sub one run this time around. Not even at half. But that's okay. That's okay. We could we could get like a real lucky run of items later on. And totally recover it, but. At least from my perspective right now, it's not looking like a good sub one. Best thing we could get out of Spiral Cave here would be the Titan's Mint, so then we could knock out Dark Side Death Mountain right away. But likelihood of that being the case is pretty slim. Ouch. Although I have called out very useful items before, so it could happen. Titans Mints, Titans Mints, Titans Mints. Ah, oh, dang. Alright. Well, we had a good go of it. Uh, okay, so what's what's the good play here? Probably backside escape and dark chest. And then go to Dark World via Kakariko. Lots of very high item concentration areas. Oh, rats are rich, 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 rich with magic tonight. Ah, there's our Titan's Mitts on the small key, and... Do we already have the burrito? We do, so that dark chest might have something. Wow, alright, Titan's Mitz is good. That gets us quicker Dark World access. Amongst other things. We still need to kill this rat for the other key though, don't we? So maybe we could have gone for this dark chest right away. And memory shit. Ow, stop it. Ow, nothing but 300 roots. I mean, that's good money, but not strictly necessary. Okay, so now we can do King's Tomb real quick and then hit Dark World. Then, if we wanted to, we could go up for uh, Dark World Death Mountain, Dark Side Death Mountain, get us a whole butt ton of other items. Precisely one butt ton of items. I kinda wish we had the flute so we could get around a little bit easier, but that's alright. It's sick kid before we go though. Sick 
activate his bombos. Don't know how necessary that's going to be. Probably not at all. Okay, so we are looking at, let's see, three, six, seven, eleven, possibly more than that, item-wise, but we'll check, uh, Bumper Cave really quick. Let's see to do this early, so I'm not stuck scratching my head where something could be, and it ends up being on Bumper Cave. Uh, nothing but a big old 20. Alright, that's good. That is a good thing to be up there. also do the Zora play too since we've got plenty of money for it. We can fake Flipper for the other items. Oh, there's number seven. Seven of twenty acquired. Oh, wow, made our money back and then some. Four items here in Thieves Town, early big ass key. Side swipes me with that fireball. Give me a break, man. Burrito. Come on, really? The fire bar was back there? Fuck off with that. Piece of shit. Probably a deep dive into the rest. The other three items that are in here. Take a dumb death here. Just knowing how this hallway goes. I don't have any backups, do I? I've got a B. So they always fucking bunch up around the spikes. Get some. Uh, no! Ah, I did that to myself. That was my fault. Ah, shit. Well, there's still three items left in there, so we're going back. Fuck it. Worth it. Worth it if even just one of the three is another piece of Dorito.
not exactly useful. But it is something. It's a compass. Which means blind, they'll have the last item here. Plus whatever's in the big chest. Yeah, our, our container, you know, it's fine. It's not a it's not a it's not a Dorito. I'm not eminently useful here, but it's something. so far. Ouch. How about we don't get bodied by this guy, please? Son of a- are you fucking serious? Alright, we're not redoing that. It's one item that we don't fucking care about, apparently. Ah, that was pretty stupid. <laughs> Whatever, it doesn't matter though, there's plenty of other things out there we can grab. We don't need to care about anything else. What am I doing? Let's do Peg Cave first. We don't have the mirror, so it doesn't matter. Our routing's gonna be shit. Number nine. Almost halfway there. Frog World Tour here. Grab the frog, we'll, we'll check out old Stumpy, hit up Hype Cave. I guess S and Q out. I mean, we don't. Well, we could go to Pod instead. I think we can go into Pod with the frog, though. Ditch him at some point. Hmm, maybe grabbing the frog is probably not a good idea. We'll see. We'll make it work. Fiverr from old Stumpy. Thanks for nothing, man. Thanks for nothing, bruh! Don't even need that five bucks. All right. 
Alright, will Hype Cave be hype this go around? Please say yes. Please be yes. Like an appropriate amount of hype here, please. Eh. Not a bad start. Boomerang is kind of meh. Big ol' 20. Okay, yeah, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Ah, oh, yeah, nothing but garbage. It's the best. Best hype cave you could possibly have. Yuck. All right, well, we gotta ditch the blacksmith here, so we gotta go drop him off quick, and then I think we're headed back up the mountain. Oh, wait, did I grab? I don't think I grabbed the king's tomb yet, did I? Let's do that real quick. Oh, no, I did. I forgot to mark it off. That's what confused me. you got for us? Please tell me you were working on the Dorito. Give me another Dorito, please. Hey, look at that! Halfway there, finally. Ugh, 46 minutes in and only halfway. Yikes. Not looking the greatest here. That's alright, we got a couple high-density areas to go to yet. Which may yet prove us wrong. You. Get out of here. Should not be able to ugh, be able to interrupt a fucking hook shot. So dumb. Uh, actually, no. Let's start from the bottom here. We'll get the super bunny chest first. It's fucking squirrels. I swear. Ugh, worse than birds. Oops. Oh, silly. Here. Alright, so we've got, let's see, four, six... Six possible items here. I think. Yeah. Kane of Brian, that gets us into Spike Cave, I think. Plus another heart container. We can get the four out of Hookshot Cave, go hit up Spike Cave, and then I guess bust a move on down to Pod. That's our best play. Another fetch quest, how great. Oh, there's another one. Alright, number 11. Big old 20 there. And, oh, number 12 there. Alright, so Hookshot Cave, the place to be for value. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Supposed to move on over to Spike Cave, preferably without dying. Fuck me. Oh my god, are you serious with that? Alright, fuck Spike Cave. We didn't even want to go there anyways. The dumbest bullshit. Oi. Alright, well our next kind of uh, high density area would be Pod. We can stop by Sahasher Shrushashrilla. Deposit the green pendant first. I guess it's something. 
Not much, but it's something. The problem here is that we really need the mirror to get it to a whole bunch of other places. The mirror is locked behind a could be locked behind a few of these spots that we skipped. That's kind of what I'm worried about here. Getting the mirror also nets us an easy two uh, Triforce pieces as well. So there's one on Spec Rock and one on Floating Island. Floating right in my path. back up here since I've been doing pretty poor on the execution. Well, 
flippers. All right, that opens up a little bit, I think. Another small key. Gets us up to uh, Zora area, at least. All right, so that either means Helmosaur's got the big key or it's floating over here somewhere. Oh wait, no, Helmosaur can't have the big key. They're... You need the big key to get to Helmosaur. <laughs> Duh. Oh, Ice Rod, that's an interesting pickup. Not what I'm strictly looking for, but hey, it's something. That'll be the big key. Okay. And yeah, not strictly what I'm looking for, but some value. Zora area is probably the play now. It's uh, most of odd was a bust. No Doritos, no like super good progressive items, I guess. Well, blue mail, I suppose, and flippers. Which, if we ever get the mirror, will get us into swamp. Silver arrows will make Helmsor a fucking pushover. Please give me a Dorito or something. Or the mirror. Mirror would be real nice. Eh? Hey! Alright. Take the Dorito. That's number 13. It's that just that much closer. Alright. It's looking like Zora area now. That'll get us four, plus Hobo is five, plus a, a peek sees at what's on the Lake Hylia Island.
we got up there? Nothing but bombs. Sir, eh, not even good for a refill. What a shit! Oh, usually you can't expect much out of them. though I guess since we've got oh there's 14 and 15 wow strong start from the waterfall we can go into ice since we've got bombos and now flippers to get over to it not exactly ideal we can avoid it but on the ledge on the ledge is the red meringue nothing of value there And from King Ripoff himself, what do we got? What do we got? Eh? Eh. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, let's not even bother with that. Unfortunately, we've got a lot of dumb, stupid one-off areas that could very well hold something of value, and I'm gonna hope that Ice Palace is where it's at. Give us a mirror or something. Loot would be nice. Better sword would be nice always. It's not looking good here. Really hate having to use Bombos to get ourselves into and through ice, but hey, what else are you gonna do, man? What else are you gonna do? This is supposed to be a short second seed. Like, Triforce hunts aren't supposed to go this long. I, think I might have just gotten lucky on the two I did last weekend. Wouldn't that just be a thing? Try 
Oh, I should have gone the other, other direction since I had a small key. Eh. Too late. We're committed. I don't have the big key yet, do I? No. Powder, that's a good backup item, but not what I'm looking for. Let's give us access to Batman. Probably gonna be the big key here. Vanilla ass big key yet again. And that means Cold Stair is gonna have the last item. Small key. All oh, right, right, okay. Big key. Yay! being an actually useful item. Probably pretty slim, huh? Oh, hey, the flute. Actually, that's very useful. Thank you. Gets us into many places. Fortunately, only fighting Cold Stare with Master Sword is going to be a bit... Concerning, but we've got two. Oh, excuse me, backup fairies, so we should be okay. Famous last words. Double KO, but I've got a fairy, so fuck you. Fuck you, Cold Stare. <laughs> oh, I would have been so irritated if I didn't have a backup fairy there. Oh, and for the fire rod, too. Alright, well, that gets us pretty much everywhere else that we need to go. My goodness, I really should have checked if uh, T Rock, what T Rock needed to open. 
so now we've got some places. We've got some places to check. I guess. We've got so many, like, little dinky one-offs we can do. Oh, I probably should have done uh, a flute first. Oh, well. Too late. I'm already committed to it. And the one thing that's really fucking up my routing, both light and dark world here, is missing the mirror. Oh, hey, there's number 16, alright. Something. A dinky one-off spot's paid off. Screws up my routing for the blacksmith, for uh, Harry's lunchbox. Can't do Cave South of the Grove or Bombos Tablets or Checkerboard Cave. Can't really easily do a lot of the very distant areas. way in the desert. Can't do a lot of cool shit without it. It's unfortunate. It cost us a lot of time to kind of route around. Wait. We do have Quake. Oh good, the other fetch quest. Great. Awesome. Thanks, Meyer Shed. So fun and cool. Uh, I guess we should do Meyer while we're here. Only good for two, but it take that long, I guess. Uh, look at all these one-off little piece of shit locations. Should probably make our way back up. Let's see if T Rock is uh, openable. Should have done that a long time ago.
Oops. Ah, oh, that was silly. I didn't want to go here. Fuck. Fuck you, stupid fireball. see but early items is okay so we can get the fuck out of here if we get another quick one Just give me the last goddamn item. I don't have to go through and be vitreous for it. Thank you! And it's actually something useful. Go figure. Alright, well, what's the next play? Probably, uh, Skull Woods. Another group of two items that should be relatively quick to grab. take longer than my normal seed. That'd be silly. Uh, there's one of them.
Fuck. Master Sword. At least I've got half magic and fire rod done. So that's something. Oh shit, the mirror. Oh, okay. Well, that opens up the rest of this bullshit. We just need to find a one more and then we will be good. Because we know where two of them are straight away. So, let's check the rest of these one-off bullshit areas. <laughs> and see if we can find just one more, because then we can finish this off. Real quick, like. Fucking mirror hiding in skull woods. Go figure. something, I guess. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Trying to think of some, like, quick ones we can go for now, but they're still really spread out. going to be uh, purple chest and bombos together. Something that prevents us from going to either T-Rock or Swamp would be real nice. That's what we're trying to do here. Up the grove on the way too. bother with anything else. There's number 18. Head on up to Spec Rock. Get number 19. And then finish it off with Floating Isle. That's something. Still managed to make this a sub-130 miraculously. That shit show. Number 19. 
All right, one more, which we'll grab in a hot minute. Not before the squirrels give me the business at least two or three more times. Yeah, fuck off. Ugh. He rocked his bomb bus, so we would have been able to go in there. Oh well. Bam! That took way too long. <laughs> Fuck 26-23. Kind of ugly. Let's be honest. Alright, fast forward, take a look at the stats, and then we'll be done for this eve. Ugh. Okay. Uh, na, 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 na. <laughs> yeah. What a spotty mess. What a spotty mess of routing that was. Not having the mirror really throws me off. Fuck you, Zora. You having a piece of candy. 500 rupees, what a waste. But I guess the important thing is we did it. We did it, and it was still better than our best uh, standard item, item rando seed. Standard Ganon defeat seed. Ah, uh, they had a Triforce piece of MSP as well. Bunch of bullshit. Took one out of immediate rotation. really curious if I clear this out now will the averages be updated yet yeah. all right so our average is now buck 18 which is still much better than our average for a normal seed so I'm not really that unhappy about it first Dorito is usually pretty quick 213 we lose a lot of steam in like the back back two thirds of it, just because it's usually by that time we're limited as to where we can go. We need some items first.
was about 10, 10 in there. Boots was really early, that's right. Remember that. Flute and Mirror were super late. So we ended up with Master Sword, didn't have to go with Plastic the entire time. I feel like most of those were not required to do. <laughs> most of those deaths. Ugh. Not a, not a great Triforce on Seed for us tonight. That's right. But that'll do it for tonight. Uh, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CDT. We'll be back on Assault Android Cactus Speedrun Practice. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.